Hey guys, today's video is going to be a video on my four favorite go-to easy hairstyles that I use constantly and these are so easy for when your hair is greasy, for when you are running out of time and all around they're just so cute that you can do basically anytime even if you are like getting all dressed up these are some good hairstyles that you can use on a daily basis like I do I mean you don't have to but I do if you guys want to know how I achieve these four favorite hairstyles of mine then please keep watching first putting dry shampoo in my hair I feel like this helps out a lot it gives my hair complete texture and it kind of makes it look a lot less greasy and it helps your hair last a lot longer. So I'm going to start with number one, the first hairstyle that I find myself doing, especially these past two weeks. First, like I said, I'm going to apply dry shampoo to my greasy hair. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to go through and just kind of tease it a little bit. going to do but that is totally up to you it's totally up to you and then I like to just pull my pieces out before I start them in the braid like I said I kind of like it a little messy so I kind of just try and like go around and just kind of like fluff it up so now let's start on the fresh braid, fish braid let me try and teach you guys how to do this so what you do is after you've tied it off, I like to split it down the middle. So you've got your two pieces right here, as you can see. And then you're gonna grab a piece from one side, doesn't matter which side you start on, and hand it off to the other side. So after you've handed it off, so I've got it, you can see how it's handed off. Then I'll grab one from the other side that I had handed it off to the first and hand it off to the one that I started off with. So it's kind of hard to get started at the beginning, but once you've got it down, it's really simple. So now I'm going to start with the first place that I grabbed the piece from and bring it to the other side and hand it off. And you can already see the fishtail has already begun. So I'm going to hand it off again. and you can already see it starting. Okay, so I'm gonna stop right there. I could go farther, but I kinda like having the hairs at the bottom. I just, I like having it kind of short and stubby looking. And then my favorite part is fluffing it up and making it just have a lot of texture and this is where I like making it kind of look messy and have pieces kind of coming out. So, I mean you can leave it here or if you're in college and you are allowed to wear hats you can maybe apply a hat to this look and have the pieces out. I don't know maybe that or you can add a hat like this and go to the beach super easy maybe since you aren't allowed to wear hats in school add the turban and there's this look so if, i hope you guys like this first look i'm going to move on to the second look and yes follow me over to the second look okay look number two this look is something i think that i've already done in one of my videos and that's a top knot bun I'm just going to go through my hair and kind of just wrap it make it look fluffy my dog is crying. So I just went through and kind of just ratted a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip my head so you guys aren't going to see me. Flip your head and pull your hair up. And after that I'm just going to kind of go like this through the hair and make it just textured. Jax, calm down. Textured. And do whatever with it. And then I'm just going to grab it. Last time I told you guys to wrap the bun, but this time I'm just going to leave it be because it's just quicker to do this because you're running late for school and or your work or whatever. 
and then just grab a hair tie and go through and just tie it in like that. What you can also do is if you're, also what you can do is if you're in high school or whatever, you can just add a turban like I would do because I do get crap for my ears so most of the time I try and just tuck them away. Voila! It's so easy, so simple, and there you go. I don't know if I explained that one super, super good. I can do it again, and I just felt like it was super self-explanatory if you just watch the video. You just pull it up, you just wrap it around, and you just stick another hair elastic in. So it's pretty simple. Add a turban, add a headband, add whatever you want, and you know, it looks pretty cute to me. I'll try this one out. <laughs> okay, moving on to number three. Yeah, so let's pretend you already put your dry shampoo on, like we already did. I don't want to cake it on too much. I just part it wherever I want to. So today I want to part it there. And right here I'm just going to add a quick, easy French braid. If you guys don't know how to do a French braid, then here we go with me teaching you. I add either a French braid or a twist, whatever I am feeling for the day. And pull this guy out. And then I grab and then I grab a hair elastic, pull him in. And then I flip it under like I'm going to do an upside down bun and then I go over that bun multiple times and then I pull in pieces and then I'll just do it again. I'm going to do another hair elastic so it's kind of crazy right now. And you know you don't have to pull this to the side I've just always kind of done it on the side but I just put another hair elastic over top of it and I just kind of wrap it around and then I go through and just tuck pieces in. Super, super simple. And I like piece, oh. And then I just kinda go through and fluff it up and then do the braid. Like I said, I love having it look kinda messy. You can have it in the back. You can add bobby pins. You can do whatever you feel like. This is just how I do my easy messy bun. My go-to easy messy bun. And you can fluff up the uh, braid even more if you want to. But that's what I do. And even if you want to, you can add a turban. But for this look, I just like to kind of leave it free and this is what I do. And then, like I said, this is my favorite one with a hat. So I'll just add the hat. And voila, there you go. Favorite hairstyle. That is my favorite. <laughs> and that's so embarrassing. Who cares? I love it. All right, last but not least, number four. This is my favorite to do if I want to get a little bit more ready than just pulling my hair up in a ponytail. This is super, super, super simple. It's easier than curling your hair, for me at least, and I feel like this is like one of my go-to hairstyles if I want to get ready for the day, but at the same time, I don't really have like tons and tons of time. So as you can see, I've already done most of it, and it's kind of sloppy because that's kind of what it's supposed to do. It looks like I used a three barrel curling iron, doesn't it? No, I did not. I used a straightener. So I left a couple little chunks over here that I'll show you how I do. So just grab your straightener, and this is really, really simple. So what I do is I'll just, I'm gonna grab a couple pieces. So first, grab this and I'm gonna curl under, okay? Don't stop, just curl under and then hurry and curl like you're gonna be flipping out. So I'm gonna curl under, flip out, curl under, flip out, curl under, flip out, 
curl under and then just keep it straight. It looks a little kinked. Don't worry, it looks a little kinked. But trust me, I work it at the very end. And you can't even tell. So I'm gonna do it again. Flip under, flip out, flip under, flip out, flip under, flip out, flip under, and then keep straight. And last but not least, flip under, flip out, flip under, flip out, flip under, keep straight. So then I'm gonna just go through with like a bigger comb and just kind of brush it out. Comb it through. Voila, there it is. So, yeah, it's not my favorite just to keep plain. I either do like two braids on the side going all the way around. But my favorite lately has just been, and it's been kind of like my go-to over the last hairstyle. And then I just grab a clear hair elastic. You can put it in a messy bun, you can put it in a ponytail, you can do whatever you want to with it. Just for this one, I'm gonna be doing a ponytail just because we're going for the quickest way. And then I'm just gonna give it some texture. And I'm gonna pull out some pieces. And then, almost done. And voila, there it is. This is like one of my favorite hairstyles to do. So easy. You guys really need to try it out. So I hope you guys like this video. I thought it kind of, I thought I would kind of mix things up a little bit and do a hair tutorial. And I thought that this was something that would help you guys out a lot because this is like my go-to four hairstyles that I do all the this is like my go-to four hairstyles that I do all the time and I felt like I really need to share them with you so that maybe you have a few more up your sleeve that you can do. So if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will love you forever. So yeah, bye.